Based on what you've seen here on my channel, you might think that I've never been shy or publicly humiliated. Well, I'm here to shatter that illusion and share with you my most horrific audition ever. And BTW, the story has never been told. Let's go back to the year 2011. I had just begun my sophomore year of college. I was studying theater because at this point in my life, I really wanted to be an actress. Freshman year was all about learning the basics of stage acting, and I was doing pretty well in my classes. But come sophomore year, that was the year of auditions. Basically, the school was going to put on dozens of stage performances, and the students had to audition to land a part. We were to audition in front of over 50 plus student directors and faculty. We were all required to perform a monologue. I had my monologue memorized. I had been practicing for days, but that day though, I was still feeling very, very nervous. I remember watching each and every single student go in one by one. Guys, no lie, I was praying. I was just praying and praying and praying over and over that I would do a good job because all I wanted was to land some roles and start my acting career. Then it was my turn. I remember walking in, seeing the last person finish up theirs, get a round of applause, and then I hear my name, and it is now my turn. I walk to my mark underneath the big spotlight, and they tell me to begin whenever I'm ready. I looked out into the stands and saw dozens and dozens of faces. Every single seat was filled. There were probably a hundred or more bodies in the room. I stood there. It was like my body and my mind detached. My body was standing still and my mind was panicking and blanking all at once. I had completely forgotten my entire monologue, everything. I couldn't think of the words. I couldn't remember anything. Even thinking back to this memory, all I remember are the blur of faces and the yellow light shining on me. It may have just been a few moments, but for me, it felt like an eternity. I stood there and I was told to go whenever I was ready. And I was pausing. And next thing you know, that pause kept going. I couldn't remember any of my lines, none of them. I didn't know where to start. I forgot what I was supposed to do. I really did just forget everything. And I just remember looking out at everybody waiting for me to say something. There was people everywhere, people in front of me, people to the side of me, people behind me, people to that side. And I freaked out and I just looked at the person that was in charge of moving everybody and I looked and I just said, I'm sorry. And I stormed out, guys. I ran out. I ran out of the audition, okay? Nobody saw me after that. I didn't say anything. Everybody was waiting for me to say something and all I could think of was to run and that's what I did. I ran. I ran out crying. The kind of crying you only do in the privacy of your own home but instead I was a grown girl crying on the college campus. I cried all the way to my car. I got in my car and cried some more. So after that, I changed my major and I lived happily ever after. I found what I was really meant to do and what I was really happy at doing. And I ended up performing in front of over a thousand people as a host. And guess what? I didn't freak out. So the lesson of this video is that just in case you ever have a really embarrassing, horrific moment and you think you won't survive or live through that ever again, you will. You will survive and you will get through it. So I hope you guys kind of learned something from my story. Uh, go ahead and share with me your most embarrassing moment or horrific moment ever in the comment section below. And I really look forward to reading all of them. Until next time, I'll see you guys later. Bye.